welcome back to Sir Assist. So today guys I'm going to be going through the UK tax regulations for cryptocurrency and NFTs. This is just a brief overview, it's very important that you do your own research on this topic as well and always seek advice from a financial advisor. And all this content is financial advice of course, as always do your own research. If you like this video, smash the like button and subscribe to the channel. If you're not signed up to survey yet, sign up using the link below. You will get a free limited card and get to draft your teams, including your Premier League team as well, on survey fantasy football. Okay guys, let's get stuck into today's content. So as I say, I'm going to be covering a brief overview of UK tax regulations, cryptocurrency and NFTs, and how this could affect you on Surare. As I say though, it's always advisable to get information from a professional tax advisor. So as the popularity of cryptocurrencies and non-fungible tokens, NFTs, continues to rise, it's crucial for individuals in the United Kingdom to understand the tax implications associated with these digital assets. And this includes these assets on Surare, which of course are the Surare cards. So in this video we'll delve into the current crypto and NFT tax laws in the UK, including how they are classified, how they are taxed and what individuals need to keep in mind when dealing with these assets. So let's bear in mind though guys that the NFT and crypto tax laws in the UK are always changing, so you always do need to make sure you're up to date on the latest information. So in the UK, cryptocurrencies are not recognised as legal tender, but they are treated as property for tax purposes. This means that when you buy, sell or exchange with cryptocurrencies, you may be subject to capital gains tax or corporation tax, depending on whether you're an individual or a company. NFTs on the other hand are unique digital assets that represent ownership of a digital item such as artwork, collectibles or virtual real estate. In the UK, NFTs are treated as property for tax purposes similar to cryptocurrencies and may be subject to capital gains tax or corporation tax. So taxation of cryptocurrencies and NFTs. As a blockchain based fantasy football game that utilises non-fungible tokens, NFTs and Ethereum blockchain, Surrey has unique tax implications in the United Kingdom. Here's a breakdown of the potential tax considerations for Surrey fantasy football NFTs and Ethereum in the UK. So we have capital gains tax. So if you are an individual in the UK and you sell your Surrey NFTs or Ethereum for profit, you may be subject to capital gains tax. The gain subject to capital gains tax is calculated as the difference between the selling price and the cost of the acquiring asset, minus any allowable expenses such as transaction fees. The current capital gain tax rates in the UK for individuals are 10% for the basic rate payers and 20% for the higher and additional rate taxpayers, with an annual capital gains tax exemption of a amount of 6000 for the tax year 2023 to 2024. Previously this was 12300 in the tax year 2022 to 23. Now another thing to note is that this capital gains tax exemption is due to go down to 3000 in the tax year for 2024-2025. Important to keep records of your transactions and accurately calculate any gains or losses for tax purposes. There's also VAT but in the UK NFTs are treated as exempt suppliers for value added tax purposes. This means transactions involving Surrey NFTs are not subject to VAT. However, it's important to note that VAT rules can change and it's always wise to stay updated with the latest regulations. So Ethereum as a cryptocurrency then. So in the UK, Ethereum is treated as a cryptocurrency and is subject to the same tax rules as other cryptocurrencies. If you use Ethereum to purchase Surrey NFTs or conduct other transactions, you may be subject to capital gains tax or corporation tax, depending on your circumstances. There may be income tax to pay as well. If you receive Ethereum as a payment for goods or services, it may be considered as income and subject to income tax. The value of the Ethereum received will be treated as the equivalent value in Great British Pound at the time of receipt and income tax would be calculated based on your income rate for the applicable tax year. Record keeping and professional advice. So keeping accurate records of all your Surrey NFT and Ethereum transactions including acquisition, disposal and allowable expenses is crucial for accurate tax reporting in the UK. It's also recommended to seek professional tax advice from qualified tax advisor or accountant who is knowledgeable in cryptocurrencies, NFTs and blockchain based games like so rare. 
Keeping track of all these transactions can be difficult to do, but our partner Surrey Tools help with this and also have some expert crypto tax partners. You can check them out using the link below. There is more information on some exclusive offers for members of Surrey Assist. It's important to note that tax laws and regulations can change and it's always wise to stay updated with the latest guidance from the HM Revenue and Customs or seek professional tax advice to ensure compliance with the UK tax laws when dealing with cryptocurrency or Ethereum. The information provided in this video is for general informational purposes only and should not be, con should not be considered as legal, financial or tax advice. Tax laws and regulations can vary by jurisdiction and are subject to change and the specific tax treatment of so rare or any other NFTs in the UK may depend on various factors including individual circumstances and interpretation of relevant tax laws by HM Revenue and Customs. It's crucial to seek professional tax advice from a qualified tax advisor or accountant who is knowledgeable in the area of cryptocurrency and NFTs and is familiar with the latest UK tax laws and regulations. It's also important to note that tax laws and regulations related to cryptocurrency and NFTs are still evolving and it's essential to stay updated with the latest guidance from HMRC or other relevant authorities. Always consult with a qualified professional before making any tax related decisions or taking any actions that may have tax implications. So guys, this was a bit of a different topic here today, but tax is a very important thing to consider if you are on so rare, especially if you are one of the bigger galleries, it's something to def definitely to consider just to check if there are any tax implications that you need to be aware of. If you like this video, smash that like button and subscribe to the channel. If you're not signed up to Surrey yet, sign up using the link below. You will get a free limited card after buying your first cards on auction. You'll also get to draft your common teams as well, including your Premier League fantasy football team. Okay guys, thanks for watching as always, and I'll see you again on the next one.